started by Andrea everything and everybody will be listed down below as usual I'm a little bit late on this one for this month it is Sailor Venus and her colors are yellow orange and red um, apparently she's all about love and everything so there's gonna be maybe some heart shapes involved in this one and I thought it would be a good opportunity to use a new stamping plate that I am currently reviewing. Um, you can see it's blue, that's because it hasn't been used yet. Uh, when you get a new stamping plate they come with this film on them. Um, in the old days it didn't used to be blue, it was like clear. So you've got to take that off before you try and use it, otherwise it won't work. So sometimes they are clear, usually on cheaper quality ones, they're clear and it can be harder to see and you're like, my stamping plate's not working. Uh, yeah, it's not working because it's got a film on it. So this stamping plate is the Born Pretty Spring Garden L005. The main image I'm actually going to use is this bit here. And I'm going to use another product that I have from Born Pretty, which I've had for a while and haven't really used very much. This is a stamping guide. Well, this is the stamping guide 02. And as you can see, sorry about the glare, it has different shapes and stuff. And I'm actually going to use this one here um, so that the little starry things are going to be in a love heart shape and I'll show you how to do that in a minute. On my nails already I have two coats of OPI's My Twin Mimi which is from the My Kitty collection. Um, it's not the best yellow actually, it was pretty horrible. <laughs> I hadn't actually put it on my nails before. Um, and on top of that I have a coat of Ultra 3's XOXO and I also have a coat of Sesh Vite because I'm going to be stamping and if I make mistakes I want to be able to get it off a little bit easier. So I am going to be stamping with this lovely orange here. This is Tribal Sun from the Miracle Gel line for uh, Sally Hansen. I also have a stamper. This is a Beauty Big Bang clear stamper. My stamping pad scraper. I have this nifty little tool thing here which is a claw so that I can clean the stamping plate. When you get a new stamping plate you should always clean it before you use it. So just get some acetone and clear it, clean it before you use it. Um, with your stamper don't put acetone on this, it will cloudy it up and make it harder to see. Uh, just clean it with soap and water when you get it. Um, and then use something like a lint roller, I guess this is my lint roller, um, to clean off any dust and debris that it gets on it and any excess nail polish. And somewhere on the table there is also a little red bow that we will be putting on one of the nails, but I can't see it at the moment. So let's just get into this. I have shaken my polish beforehand, like you should. to get the star right on the edge which has kind of messed up the step so I'm going to do it again but that is basically what we are going to be doing.
place it on the nail. It's not the perfect, but I will be doing something to it which will help it a little bit in a minute. just going to do a, well, try to do the full nail. Um, the design area might not be big enough for my nail, but we will try. Just make it look more interesting. I'm going to get some tape Oops. to clean up. Just ordinary sticky tape to clean up around the sides of the nail. And take it off anywhere you don't want it on the nail. This is actually a good way of like doing Sometimes you can get it to lift up a whole section. It doesn't always work. is uh, racy. Put some out on my little palette. And then I have a paint brush. This is a thin striper brush. Might be a bit big for what I want. But we'll make it work. If I could be in frame for you, that would probably help. So I'm just going to outline the heart in red. Oh, there we go. 
And then I'm going to locate my little uh, red bow, which I'm not sure where it went. Well, I could not find my little red bow, so I pulled out the whole packet. I know it's on here, on the table somewhere, but it has vanished. Um, I'm going to put another layer of sesh feet on top of the nails with the hearts on it to seal the design. Basically a stick with some white tack on the end of it, which is like blue tack, only white. Mm. Stick on my little pole. And there we have it. Super quick and simple manicure for Sailor Venus for one month one Sailor Senshi. If you want to see what the other guys are doing, there's like makeup looks. Kara did like a really great one. Um, mascara cakes. Uh, there's makeup looks, there's panning projects, um, other nail art, that kind of thing. So check everybody out. Um, if you want to subscribe, click the button down below. Leave me a thumbs up if you like nail art type videos. Uh, leave me a comment down below and I will see you in my next video. See ya.